Hey there, tech enthusiasts and smart home lovers. Today we're diving deep into some exciting leaks about Google's upcoming Nest Learning thermostat and temperature sensor. We'll be covering everything from design changes to new features, so stick around to learn all about these cool gadgets that might just revolutionize your home's climate control. In this video, we'll be exploring the new Nest Learning thermostat design, two, user interface updates, three, the redesigned Nest temperature sensor, four, battery life improvements, five, pricing and availability, six, how these upgrades compare to previous models. So let's jump right in and explore what Google has in store for us. All right, folks, let's kick things off with the star of the show, the brand new Nest Learning Thermostat. Now it's been a hot minute since we've seen a major update to this smart home staple. The last big refresh was way back in 2015 with the third generation model. But hold on to your hats because it looks like Google is finally ready to shake things up. According to our reliable tipster, Arsene Lupin, the fourth generation Nest Learning Thermostat is getting a serious facelift. Picture this a sleek, modern device with a larger display that's bound to catch your eye as soon as you walk into the room. But here's where it gets really interesting. The edges of the display are curved with glass, giving it a premium, almost futuristic look. Now, for those of you who love the physical ring on the old model, don't worry, it's still there. But Google's done some nipping and tucking. The new ring is much thinner than what we saw on the third gen model. It's so slim, in fact, that it's a bit tricky to spot from head on. But rest assured, it's there, presumably still allowing you to adjust your settings with that satisfying twist we've all come to love. One thing that's immediately noticeable is how much more modern this new thermostat looks compared to its predecessor. It's like Google took a page out of Apple's book and decided to give their smart home tech a high-end makeover. The smooth surface is a far cry from the more utilitarian look of the third gen model, and I for one am here for it. Now that we know about the exterior, let's talk about what you'll see when you actually use this bad boy. Google hasn't just given the Nest Learning Thermostat a physical makeover, they've revamped the user interface too. The leak suggests that Google has put some serious thought into modernizing the UI. While we don't have all the nitty gritty details just yet, it's safe to say that the interface is getting a fresh coat of paint to match its snazzy new exterior. One interesting tidbit from the leak is a redesigned climate screen in the Google Home app. This new screen apparently shows both temperature and Aki that's air quality index for those of you playing at home. This could be a game changer for those of us living in areas with air quality concerns. Imagine being able to check not just how warm or cool your home is, but also how clean the air is all from one screen. There's also speculation that the new thermostat might be controlled by touch, similar to the more budget-friendly $129 Nest thermostat released in 2020. This would be a significant shift from the primarily dial-controlled interface of previous learning thermostat models. But here's where it gets really interesting. Remember how I mentioned that regulatory filing last month? Well, it hinted at something pretty cool, the inclusion of Soli radar technology. For those not in the know, Soli is Google's radar-based motion sensing tech. In the context of the Nest thermostat, it could be used to detect when you're approaching the device and light up the screen automatically. Even cooler. This tech could potentially be used to sense if anyone's around at all, powering Google's home away routines. Imagine your thermostat automatically adjusting based on whether you're home or not, without you having to lift a finger. Now, that's what I call smart. All right, folks, let's talk about the unsung hero of the smart thermostat world, the temperature sensor. Google's not just stopping at updating the thermostat itself, they're giving the Nest temperature sensor a makeover too. Now, for those of you who might not be familiar, the current Nest temperature sensor is a nifty little device that works with the learning thermostat and the discontinued thermostat E. It's a battery powered wireless extension that lets you monitor temperatures in other rooms of your house. Pretty cool, right? Well, get ready for the Nest temperature sensor 2.0. The leak reveals a completely redesigned sensor that's bound to turn heads. Picture this a smooth, egg-shaped device that looks more like a piece of modern art than a tech get. It's got a minimalist vibe that's miles away from the current sensor's more practical appearance. One of our sources described it as looking like a steamed bun, and I've got to say, that's pretty spot on. It's got this soft, rounded look that's going to blend seamlessly into any room decor. No more hiding your sensor behind a plant or a picture frame this little beauty is meant to be seen. And here's a fun tidbit, the new sensor apparently looks a bit like a Nest Mini, but without any Google branding on the face. It's small enough to sit discreetly on a desk or shelf, so you don't have to worry about sticking it to a wall if that's not your thing. All right, tech lovers, let's talk about everyone's favorite topic when it comes to gadgets battery life. Because let's face it, even the coolest device can be a pain if you're constantly having to change the batteries, right? Well, I've got some great news for you. According to the leak, the new Nest temperature sensor is getting a serious upgrade in the battery department. The current model lasts about two years before needing a battery change. 
Not bad, but Google's decided to take it up a notch. The new sensor? It's expected to last a whopping three years on a single battery. That's a 50% increase in battery life, folks. Just think about it, that's one less thing you'll have to worry about for an entire extra year in the world of smart home tech, where we're all about convenience. This is a pretty big deal. Now, the leak doesn't specify if this improvement comes from a change in battery type. The current sensor uses a CR23V lithium battery, and it's unclear if the new model will stick with this or opt for something different. But regardless of how they've done it, a longer battery life is always a win in my book. Now, I know what you're all thinking this all sounds great, but how much is it going to cost me? Well, I've got some good news for you budget-conscious smart home enthusiasts out there. Let's start with the Nest temperature sensor. Despite all the fancy upgrades and the sleek new design, it looks like Google is planning to keep the price point the same as the current model. That means you can expect to shell out about $40 for a single sensor, or if you're looking to outfit your whole home, you can grab a three-pack for $100. Not too shabby for a device that's gotten a significant makeover and battery upgrade, right? As for the new Nest Learning Thermostat itself, we don't have concrete pricing information just yet. However, here's an interesting tidbit Google has been discounting the third gen Nest Learning Thermostat by $80, bringing it down to $169 at various retailers. Could this be a sign that they're clearing out old stock to make way for the new model? Certainly possible. Now let's talk about when we might actually get our hands on these shiny new gadgets. While we don't have an official release date yet, we do have a pretty good idea of when we might hear more. Google's got a big hardware event coming up on August 13th, and while it's expected to focus mainly on the Pixel lineup, there's a good chance we'll get some official word on these new smart home products too. All right, tech enthusiasts, let's put on our comparison hats and see how these new devices stack up against their predecessors. Starting with the Nest Learning Thermostat, we're looking at the first major update since 2015, that's nearly a decade of the same design and features, which is practically an eternity in tech years. The new model seems to be a significant leap forward in terms of design. The larger display with curved glass edges is a far cry from the more utilitarian look of the third gen model. It's like going from a flip phone to a smartphone, same basic function, but a whole new level of sophistication. The potential inclusion of solely radar technology is another game changer. This could make the thermostat more intuitive and responsive than ever before. Imagine walking into a room and having your thermostat light up and adjust automatically, that's some serious sci-fi level stuff right there. As for the Nest temperature sensor, the upgrades are equally impressive. The new egg-shaped design is a significant departure from the current puck-like shape. It's gone from something you might want to hide to a device you'd be happy to have on display. And let's not forget about that battery life upgrade, an extra year of life is nothing to sneeze at. When we look at the overall package, the sleeker designs, the upgraded tech, the improved battery life, it's clear that Google is making a concerted effort to keep its smart home offerings at the cutting edge. These aren't just minor tweaks, they represent a significant evolution in Google's smart home ecosystem. And there you have it, folks, a comprehensive look at what we might expect from Google's new Nest Learning thermostat and temperature sensor. From sleek new designs to improved functionality and battery life, it looks like Google is pulling out all the stops to keep its smart home tech ahead of the curve. Now, I want to hear from you. What feature are you most excited about? The new design, the potential solely radar integration, or maybe you're just psyched about not having to change your sensor's battery as often? Let me know in the comments below. And hey, if you enjoyed this deep dive into the latest smart home tech, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. We've always got the latest tech news and reviews coming your way and you won't want to miss out.